The Environmental Career Symposium caught the attention of many high school students and even one international college student who came to the United States to further his education. The possibility of being able to work in a field where you're studying in, it excites you. It's an event where you can meet local companies, see the opportunities that are there, get feedback. It's super important. And really it is an opportunity for us to get members of the public and private sector together with undergrads and then high school juniors and seniors and even people looking to make a change in their career. On this Saturday, students fill the TXU headquarters. Organizers say that the goal is to promote the advancement of environmental related careers. Carl Schmidt is a junior at Allen High School and says he dreams of working in biology. When he heard about this symposium, he knew he had to come. But I was also thinking of environmental science, considering you know the competition that there is in biology, and if that doesn't go out well, then I could do environmental science. The room was filled with at least 14 vendors made up of different environmental companies and even local groups like STEM Insights, part of Dallas County Community Colleges. Our website kind of helps them with uh, visualize their future, such as what careers they want to choose, like also like uh, internship-wise, how much money they can make, or is their job even sustainable for the future to come. You can go into so many different types of engineering within environmental and then you can go into like public policy or like environmental conservation. Companies like Bayou Tech Services provide environmental regulation services like water testing. The owner Benjamin Head says that this day isn't so much about his company but rather about educating as many students as possible. Yes exposure is good but to help them to decide what their future uh, may entail and, and how to get there and what works and what doesn't work. So if I can help them to be successful, that's our goal today. Students had an opportunity to hear two panel sessions from various speakers. Okay, is it appropriate for me to email my vice president? It could be yes, it could be no. When I was younger, I went to an event similar today and it changed my path in my career. And someone will be here today that will radically change what they do in life. And I think we owe that to the generation that comes behind us to create the opportunities like the city of Irving is doing today. And if everything goes as planned, it will be back once again next year. Benjamin Diaz for City Source. Our next panel will start at 3 or maybe a little bit after 3. So if all our 3 o'clock panelists can make their way up to the